Hello everybody and welcome back. My name is Digi and today I'm going to show you how to get all the secret characters in Fredbear's Mega Roleplay. So our first one is secret character number one. Head inside of the pizzeria, then go down the hallway to the end, then take a left and enter the parts and service room. You will then find a arcade machine here and what you got to do is wait till 2 a.m. To then interact with Shadow Freddy that shows up on the screen. So you can just stand here and wait till it pops up. You have about till, I think, 3 a.m. So you have one hour in game to get it. All right, and there it is at 2 a.m. You can interact. You guys can leave your flashlight on you and you'll get the badge. Secret character number two. So we're gonna go inside of the pizzeria, then head down the hallway. And then go inside of the employee's room. This is the office. Right here on this wall is where we're going to wait till 3 a.m., okay? At 3 a.m., Shadow Bonnie will pop up right here on the screen, on the wall. And you're going to click on him, and you'll be good to go. You have about another hour in-game to get him. All right, it's 3 a.m., and there he is. You don't even have to get turn off your flashlight. Just interact with them. You'll get the badge, but you will die. Secret character number three, it's been updated. So what you're gonna wanna make sure first is actually go ahead and not be a human. What you've gotta do is go ahead and choose Chica. Get a Chica. Once you're a Chica, we're gonna head over this way to the arcade room. Now, sadly, she does not have any running so you're gonna have to slowly make your way over there. Now, what you're gonna wanna do, this is a time sensitive badge, okay? You have to go to the arcade room and be here around 10 p.m. by this vent. So what you can do right now is go ahead, open up that vent, and then get into a crawling position as Chica. Because what we're gonna be doing is collecting three cupcakes. Yes, I know it is the same as the old version of this badge. However, some of the spots have been slightly changed. So I'm just showing you guys the updated version of secret character number three. So once 10 o'clock comes around, I'm going to go ahead and put on my uh, night vision. There we go. And I'm going to head down into the vent and collect our first uh, cupcake which is going to be right here. And what you actually have to do is interact with it like that. Boom. Once you've gotten that cupcake, we're going to go ahead and stand right back up like so and head over to our next room. It's going to be down over here. And we're going to the good old room of parts and service. That's right. So take go ahead. Take chicken nuggets on legs over to employees only. This is the parts and service room. Once you've done that, go into this vent right here. Go into baby crawl mode. There we go. There we go. That's a good chicken. Good chicken. And then our second cupcake is going to be right over there. That's a delicious looking cupcake. It must be dark chocolate. Then our last and third one is literally going to be back out here right inside of this locker interact with it it will close and that is how you get the secret character number three secret character number four so in order to get this badge you're gonna have to click three buttons in a certain group order so the first group of buttons i'm gonna call them group number one are gonna be outside our first one can be hidden there's three locations for each of these groups so the first spot can be right here on the side of the building. Just look for a button and interact with it. The second spot could be over here in this corner. And then the last spot, if it's at none of those, should be right over here. There it is, my first button. Now group number two, those locations are gonna be inside the pizzeria. So let's go ahead, walk in here, head down the hallway this way then go down this hallway. Then in front of the bathrooms, go to the one on the left. This is the Chica bathroom, and there is my button for me. It is right here by the mirror. The other spot is over here in parts and service. Walk inside, 
and it should be down here at the bottom near the table and the last hidden spot for the group number two go here into main stage then run on over to pirates cove then the button could be right here on this small little part of the wall then once you've gotten your two buttons the third group group number three two of them are gonna be right over here go to arcade then head over to the vent my button is right here by the vent boom then once you push your third button a interactable door will open or a non-interactable door will open but i'm gonna show you guys the other spots the other spot could be over here in puppets gift box could be right here on the wall then the other one and final location of group number three can be outside that's right it can be outside way over here keep going over here then go to the left past the purple guy car and go to the little rock over here by the tunnel and it can be actually on top of this rock the third button for group number three so once you have all your buttons pushed and you've got that cutscene, then head over to parts and service or the employees only room right over here. Then go off to this side. The door is open. Interact with the spring Bonnie mask. I already have the badge. Secret character number five. I've already made a video of this, but they've updated it just a bit and actually made it a little easier. So go ahead into the pizzeria, then off to the left. Go into party room one. Now, you're going to see this light up here. When it goes completely dark like that, it is starting over. And what it's doing is giving you a four digit code. And when it's blinking, that means it's get you have to count the blinks, okay? You go one, two, three, you count those blinks. And then when it has like a slight pause, that means it's giving you the next number, okay? So it goes one, two, three, four, five, pause a little, and then one, two, three, pause, one, two, three, four. It's going to be random also. My number will be different from your number in every server. So do not copy my number. It won't work unless you somehow end up with the same one. Also, if you turn on the in-game sound, you will hear like a buzzing, clicking sound. That's another way you can count the number it's giving you instead of the blinking so there's multiple ways count the blinking count the sound they should be the same all right so we're gonna do this together so one two three four five all right so five one two three four five six seven eight nine nine okay one 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 two three all right, so my code is 5913. Again, when it goes black like that, that means it's going to start over. All right, so once you've got your code, we're going to go this way, then down the hallway all the way, then go to our left, enter the parts and service room, and you're going to see a doorway right here. Interact with it. So 5913, boom, there we go. Now we've got to go down the stairs here. Now, this is where it's a little more simple. Starting from this doorway right here, we've got to click three buttons in a specific order. Our first one is going to be over here in the back right corner. It's going to be kind of tucked away under a shelf right there. Boom. Press E. Boom. Then if we go back here to this, uh, the door, we're going to then go to the back left corner here where there is a button there it is on the wall press to interact then we're heading back to the door again and going to the right side where there should be a button on the wall that should then light up all the lights you press this oh hold on need to hold it down a little bit longer opens up the elevator door and there is our unlock secret character number five secret character number six so we're gonna go into the pizzeria then down the hallway you don't have to go this way exactly there are multiple ways to get to where i'm going then enter the main stage room go to the kitchen so if you know multiple ways to get the kitchen great 
But once you're in the kitchen, there will be a stove, an oven. Open up that oven. And inside that oven is bread. And that is Bread Bear, AKA secret character number six. Secret character number seven will actually be outside over to Purple Guy's car. What we're gonna do then is turn your camera like this until you get the unlock interaction, all right? So it's actually inside. I wonder if there's anything inside. Oh, you're actually interacting with Purple Guy's hat. So interact with that. Boom, you'll get this staticky craziness. Then you'll be teleported to a different game. And now we've got to find the spare security key, fence key, sorry, to get to the hall. So the key will be over here to our left. You can't sprint, you can't zoom out. Boom, there's the key. The fence door will open, and we're gonna walk this way down the hallway. Oh my gosh, it's still called hallway too. <laughs> That's funny. That's where the old, old location used to be. So we're gonna run this way to the mirror towards ourselves because look at us, we're so beautiful. Run to yourself. Run, you fools. Keep going until that shatters, then go to your left into the office we're gonna go to the chair yes you move slower than a snail go ahead and bump into that chair and then it's gonna pretty much do all this by itself um you can move your screen like this up to you but all right um flashlight doesn't matter you just gotta wait till the fire starts happening and that's when the craziness begins there we go there's the fire and what that fire is going to do is slowly come closer to you or slowly burn the place it depends if it's being friendly or not usually fire is not friendly so prepare yourself when the fire goes all up into your face in a few seconds it should be right about oh yep here we go should be oh dog hair should be come on do it Boom, and then click on the little guy right there in front of you, and you will get the badge. All right, secret character number eight. Over this way towards this side of the map, and what you're looking for is a sewer top or a manhole. Boom, go down it. Come on, sometimes it's a little difficult if you got sprint on. I suggest get out your flashlight, and now what you're gonna do is this obby. You can do this while sprinting or not sprinting. Right here, I'd suggest turning it off. Oh, nope, <laughs> not falling over. <laughs> that is not what I wanted. You just do a little hop here. Right here, I do suggest using a sprint, but be careful because then you might go a little too far. And then here, I think we can, yeah, we can go through those pipes. And now we gotta do this. Boom, 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 boom. Turn on your sprint here. Just get on top of this pipe boom and now once you're at the end interact with the smoke and that's how you get secret character number eight secret character number nine let's go inside the pizzeria grab our slice of pizza just kidding go over here to the office on our left and there should be a group of drawings here all you have to do is interact with that and that is how you get secret character number nine secret character number ten is actually outside in the back here. So cross the street, look both ways, don't get hit by cars. Grab this shovel here, boom. Now we got shovel. Take shovel to dirt. Step on dirt, shovel auto dig. Interact with treasure chest. That is how you get secret character number 10. And as a bonus, if you stuck around, I am now gonna tell you how to get Monty Gator. What we've gotta do is collect his golf ball. So go to the side of the pizzeria this way. It is the fastest way. You don't have to go through all the rooms. Go behind this rock. You even see alligator footprints. Interact with the golf ball. You now have golf ball in pocket. Go ahead in through the kitchen here and go into the main stage room. Then head over to the glam rock corner. This is it. Then go past the, hello, wet floor bot. Go over here into Monty's golf. There is a barrel. If you can't find it, there are footsteps going to it. Interact with it to return the golf ball. And that's how you get Monty Gator. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe down below, and join the Badge Hunting Squad today. 
Use star code DIGI whenever you buy Robux or Premium. And check out my UGC items, my head, my shoulder buddy, and the badge hunting wings. All those will have a link down below. Love you all. As always, stay awesome, stay cool, and go love badge hunting. Bye-bye.